Hey guys, I decided to do the $20 makeup tag that's been going around on YouTube, and this is the look that I came up with. Um, so you can see my eyes and stuff, but um, I spent a little under $20 to get this look. I think it came out pretty good. Um, definitely took me a while to pick out all the stuff and try to decide what would look good together and make sure that I don't go over my little budget. But if you want to see how I get this look, then and the just first keep thing watching. I'm going to be using this New York Color Smooth Skin Liquid Makeup. And this one is in Classic Beige. So let's see. Ah, it's going to be backwards. Okay, this is 309 at Target. So I just put some on my hand. Start. I've never used this before, so I'm kind of curious to see how it how it comes out. It's kind of like thick, but I normally use bare minerals. And I'm trying to, I know I'm putting it on a little heavy, but I don't have a concealer to use. So, yeah. Let me back up some. I don't know if that's it's having a hard time to focus. I'm gonna have to fast forward through this. <laughs> Just because it seems like it's taking forever. I don't know if I got it on my lip. So. So now we're done with that. Hold on one second. Okay, my hair. So you can see a little bit better in this. Make sure I got everything. Okay. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take e.l.f. Golden Bronzer. Looks like this. brush. It's just their, it's a total face brush. It's just a dollar. I'm going to just swirl that in it. Tap it off. It does have a little shimmer to it, just so you know. So now that I got that on, oh, I look so washed out. I know I should have done this during the day when I had better lighting, but it's raining today, so couldn't help that one out. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do, this is the e.l.f. All Over Color Stick. And it is in Pink Lemonade. I promise you it doesn't smell like that. So I'm just going to dab it on like that and then bring it out towards my hairline. I just want to add just a little bit of color to it and this was only a dollar. And this can be used on your cheeks your eyes and your lips and I'm actually going to be using this on my lips too. See, just um, use it just a little bit of color to it, not a whole bunch. You can work it up. Um, when it, you first dab it on it is um, a little 
bold, but once you smooth it in, it looks pretty good. So then I, the next thing I'm going to take is the e.l.f. translucent mattifying powder. looks like this. I'm going to use the little sponge that comes with it, and I'm going to just tap this powder on, or tap it, put the powder on over the parts that I usually get shiny, which is like mainly my T-zone and my cheeks. This was three dollars, just so you know. Okay, and then now on to eyes. Okay, I'm gonna use my e.l.f. eyelid primer. This is only a dollar. I know you're not supposed to do this, but I do it. Or, you know, put it straight from the wand onto it, but I do it and I don't have any problems with it, so. Okay, okay, so what I'm going to be using on my eyes is Wet n Wild Walking on Eggshells. You just have this whitish color that's going to go in your brow bone, a taupe, it's going to go all over, and then a little darker brown for your crease. And I'm going to be using the little applicators that come with it, just so you see. And I will be right back. Okay, so I got my one eye done, and I used this NYC Cool Brow Eyeliner Pistol in 922 Dark Brown, and I used that on my eyebrows and then on my eyelid and my waterline. And then also on this side from the mascara, I used e.l.f. Lengthening and Voluming Mascara. So that's what that looks like. So anyway, let me go ahead and put my other eye together, and I like the Wet n Wild eyeshadows, but it's a lot of fallout with it. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put the bottom eyeshadow on. This is the one that has the, it's marked eyelid, so it's kind of dummy proof. It's so weird doing this, looking through my little screen. Okay, I'm going to use the other side of it and get into that crease color. Like you can definitely use these things to put your makeup on, but man, a make a brush is so much easier. close enough. Okay, I'm going to take this little brush here and I'm going to dip it in the this top one right here, this brow bone. Bring it under here like so and then I'm going to use this to help blend out some of those lines so it doesn't look so harsh. And let's see. Thing I'm gonna do is take the NYC pencil and then line it. This might be hard. <laughs> One 
one thing I don't like about this is it doesn't show up that well. I'm gonna use it on my waterline. Okay. Next thing I'm gonna do is use this e.l.f. Mascara. Oh, and by the way, that pencil works really good on eyebrows, and it's only 97 cents. Now, I think if I had gotten black and used it for my, my eyeliner, I don't think it would have been that bad. I'm just not, I normally don't put brown. Sorry. <laughs> ah, sorry. <laughs> Hold on one second. Okay. So, and then the last thing I'm going to do, let me zoom out, to finish my look off, is take this, the little all over color stick that I had put on my cheeks, and I'm just going to put a little bit on my lips and rather yeah and it kind of makes like a stain you can't fill it at all just to give me a little bit of color so just a little recap of how much everything costs me zoom out some more um Oh, okay. And here's another little look. Check out my eyes. Everything. So, the... I have a little cheat. Cheat sheet. Okay, my foundation was $3.09. The bronzer was $3. The e.l.f. cheek all over stick that I put on my lips and on my cheeks was $1. The translucent powder, which is also by e.l.f., e.l.f. was $3. I can't talk today. I don't know what's my problem. The uh, Wet n Wild Eye Shadow Trio was $2.99. The NYC Eyebrow Eyeliner Stick was $0.97. Cents. The e.l.f. Primer for my eyelids was $1. The brush that I used for the bronzer was $1. And the mascara was $3, bringing it to a total of $19.05. So I definitely got it under $20. I think it looks pretty good. Um, I, would, I would wear it out. The only thing... Um, I'm not too crazy on, like, as far as the foundation, I think it gives me a pretty good coverage. Um, I like it. I don't look orange, and that's what I really hate about buying some of the, you know, cheaper foundations. Sometimes you, they have that effect on you. I don't look orange, but I am not too big on the eyeliner. I do like how it did on my eyebrows. I would probably use it for my eyebrows, just definitely not for my eyelids, and um, I think, oh, and this brush, it is a dollar. It's not that great, though. Um, actually, it's shedding right now. But it's pretty rough, and I would never, like, I'll never use it again unless there's another little challenge. But I love the Wet n Wild eyeshadow. I think it's really, I think it's really good. Um... There's a lot of fallout with it, so you kind of got to watch for that. As far as the e.l.f. mascara, I like it. Um, if I, I think it would have worked a little better if I could have curled my eyelashes, but I didn't have enough room to put my eyelash, or, yeah, my eyelash curler in it. I swear to God, I can't talk. So anyway, yes, this is my look for $20. I hope you like it. Please subscribe and comment below and check out my other videos. Thanks. Bye, guys.